Hello guys, and today I've got a tutorial for you. Um, now, this m might not get a big audience, but basically, as you've read in the title uh, above, it's how to use an Xbox 360 controller on like, any game you like, um, even even if like originally you're not able, such as Minecraft, or just using the computer like here and moving my mouse with my Xbox controller. So basically. Uh, I'll have all the script like the links down in the description and the download files, and you're gonna download something on um, the Mac, which is free, which is called Controller Mate. Now, um, this does require a registration code, but that will also be down in the description. So just copy and paste them into the register place, and then yeah, then you're gonna open this, which is what I'm gonna send. Like you can download in the download description. And if we open that, by the way, as you can see there, that is the registration code right there. Now it'll come up with this button, and you just want to click save as or whatever. Um, but seeing as I've already done that, you come up with something like this. You want to click on this little arrow, click on this, right, locomotion. So you've got your WADS movement. So now this is your movement. So if you look, when I'm turning that, watch these here 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 and here okay they change so that is the uh dialogue stick on the right then we have our one on the left now this like really triggers a lot of them um so like up is uh i think that no, up is w uh, right is D, then A, and back is S. So it's like the general uh, arrow keys sort of thing, but with the you know, letters. We've got the button layout. We've got, um, so we've done them. We've got escape, which is the middle button. So like the X button in the center of the Xbox. Then, let's see what, right, so X is inventory for Minecraft, and that is E, so whatever E does on your game, and you can always alter these and alter your game settings. You then have Y, which is like shift, so which is like crouch on Minecraft, again, change it to whatever. You have B, uh, the uh, B button, which is like uh, destroying items, which is Q for me, um, but I have changed that around quite a lot. Um, you then have A, which is jump, which would be space. Then have the back button um, on the left hand side of the middle button, if you didn't know that. Um, which is P, and then you have uh, your uh, D pad. So if you press sideways on the D pad, it actually scrolls through your in inventory items, which I really like. Um, I'm not sure what the right bumper does. Um, something I've got to look at. Um, so we've got Y. Oh, and start button is also escape. So you can either press start or the middle button. you got that to place. Okay. So once... So which you've got that so if you like uh can't remember how you get here just have to have a look um maybe if you go to minecraft <laughs> right basically it will say name minecraft enabled the the contents of group are active so basically it says if the following are running then you can choose what programs and if the following are not running but i put it on always because I use Spoutcraft as well, and you can't use Spoutcraft as a selected program, but having on all the time just makes it so much easier, because uh, you can use it for anything then. Um, so, basically, if you are using Minecraft, um, just close that. You will want to save it, but I don't want to save it, because it's like, I've already got it set up for mine. So don't shave, don't shave. Right, so then we'll go into say Spoutcraft because Spoutcraft is just so much better than Minecraft, even though it's the same game, 
just a different launcher. Login. What? No, not yet. I'm not gonna update Spoutcraft just yet. That is quite annoying. But yeah, I'm not gonna update Spoutcraft yet because I want to make sure I can join my server. So there you go. <laughs> As this time, let's go to multiplayer. Go to my server. Not many people on. Man, load. I mean, we could have even just done it in the main menu. I'm just gonna. <sighs> let's say it's best probably to disconnect, and then we'll just go to main menu and options. Now, in this, you do get a lot more, so. Try and base it on this. If I these are just all the basics what you'd ha have in Minecraft. So if we make that a bit, oh, don't want to do that. Make that a bit bigger. It's flashing for some reason. But yeah, so these are like some of the settings you want. So if you want to pause the video, look at that so you can see all of it there. F to you. You see all, what they all do, and that is the perfect configuration. For using um, a controller that on that well the download file unless you change things that's fine especially if you use hack clients it's good to change things because I used to have this one and it used to be like on something like N for placing and it used to do auto nuke all the time every time I tried to play something which wasn't too good you know I got a nasty surprise there so the download will be in the description uh, and the registration key and I hope you check it out and. 